Right, we've now got a order of operations, otherwise what you might know as bid mass. Typical question would be something like this. Now, if you didn't recognize that this was bid mass, if people didn't recognize that was bid mass, I think most people would probably do five add two, seven, seven times three, 21. Well, it's wrong. What you do is, looking at this thing here, the chart, you've got a timesing operator and you've got an adding operator. Now clearly timesing is above adding, it's higher up the chart. So you do the timesing bit first. Two times three is six. So all of that becomes six. Five add six is 11, that's the correct answer. Right. Just out of interest, I want to show you this. Now, a lot of you, might, a lot of you will probably say, "Well, we've got adding there, and you got subtraction." Then, what you might want to do is, because adding is above taking away, you'd want to do adding first. So you do five add two is seven. Seven take away two is six. Perfectly okay. But what if you had it the other way around? Let's say you had five take away two plus one. Now what? Well, you're gonna say, well, adding is on top of taking away. So do adding first. All right then, two plus one is three. Five take away three is two. Well, let's try this on the calculator. Five, take away two, add one. Oh, it gives me four for some reason. So clearly this one's wrong. This one is wrong. They're saying the calculator is showing that this is correct. Why? Well, whenever you've got adding and taking away, notice they're in the same division. They're, they're, they're in the same di division. A different division from, sorry, a different category. They're in the same category or same league. Here, the dividing and times in, in a separate league, indices, another league, and they're right at the top of the league, you've got the brackets. So whenever you've got adding and taking away together in the same calculation, don't think about, oh, uh, plus first, then minus. All you've got to do is work from left to right, from left to right. So all you've got to do is five take away two is three, three add one, gives it the four, which is the correct answer. So whenever the same operators belong to the same league, work from left to right. Right, another question. Let's try that one. And maybe, okay, I'm gonna try making a question with that in there as well. So let's, let's try this. So what have we got there? So I've got indices, I've got division, and I've got the adding there. And they're all in separate leagues. Look, that's separate. So we do indices first. Two squared, two times two is four. That becomes four. So indices out the way. Then we've got the division. Division first, then the adding. So we'll do the division first. Eight divided by four is two. Just adding left over, eight up two equals to 10. Uh, let's try one, let's try another one. Let me make up the question and then I'll put the beads along the chart. Let's try uh, this one here. We'll do that one, let's try this one. Let's try this one again. Remember last time the answer was four because you do uh, five take away two is three, three add one is four. Remember when the operators are in the same league, you just work from left to right. But if you want to force it to do this bit first, I have to put brackets around it. So now what do we have? We've got brackets. Uh, we've got subtraction. Right, they're on the opposite ends of the league. Okay. Anyways, right, two plus one, brackets first. Two plus one is three. 
the pull of that becomes three. And then five take away three leaves you with two.